everything that we sense is our character, our worldview. All that is just the result of all our running programs. A completely different life is possible, a completely different way of being is possible by diving into all our active conflicts and slowly um, cleaning up. Video studio is not easy when you cannot walk. <laughs> Sweating. Oh. Each and every day makes me more and more grateful for, for my feet and for my legs and for the ability to be able to walk. It's coming back soon. <laughs> when I look back into my years in school, biology class, wasn't something I was really looking forward to. It felt too far away from reality. We were studying some like ribosomes, some like small things inside a cell. And I was like, I don't know, what, what is it? And what impact does it have on my everyday life? And like, it felt, it felt too far away. But what I'm doing right now with my studies of the five biological laws and this will be the topic of today's session I get a deeper understanding of how this incredibly sophisticated apparatus really works and this not only strengthens my skill to think systemically and at the same at the same time it deepens my appreciation for this apparatus and I get into deeper contact with the incredible miracle that life is. And it like it baffles me how almost nobody of us really understands this intricate system. How does my body work? What does it really do? Wow. Wow 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 wow. I just recorded the second session for our Custodia Lab Library. An introduction to the five biological laws. And friends, this topic is so, so, so important. Not only through my process of what's going on with my foot, I realize how important that is. Like, it's so important. Yesterday I, I read the sentence that everything that we sense is our character, our worldview. All that is just the result of all our running programs. A completely different life is possible, a completely different way of being is possible by diving into all our active conflicts and slowly um, cleaning up. Yeah. So much of what we think this is how we are. I'm introvert, I'm this, I'm that, I'm loud, I'm whatever. A lot of that is just the result of a special biological program that is running inside my system caused by a conflict shock, caused by a gap between my most primal needs and the current reality. And when things are running for months or even years, like, yeah, it's intense. And this is our invitation to dive into that and to learn. Yeah. Aber weißt du, ähm, Bertie, so ein äh, Rollerkauf, also ein Glück, dass du dir den nicht gekauft hast. Welchen denn? Na, hier der andere. Äh, Stefan. Der Stefan hat so einen ganz riesigen, ja. Ach du, ja, ich musste da hinten drauf sitzen. Hast du das geschafft? Und der ist riesig, ich ne? sag, ich brauche eine Leiter. Ja, 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 der ist riesig, ich weiß. <lacht> wow, Friends. Currently editing the session, editing Custodia Lab, five biological laws session. I'm sitting here outside, it's starting to rain in a couple of minutes. Can you hear that? Mother 
guy is. Yes. It's pumping. Mm, this topic is so important, I can tell you. This topic is so, so, so important. Really understanding how our bodies work should be like mandatory for each and every one. This is something we should learn from age six on. Like This should be like basic education. What's really going on inside my chest, inside my feet, inside my ear, inside my eyes and so on. Like this should be like basic education. Yeah. And since it's that important, I cannot just put it into our custodia lab. Although that's super nice to be able to share that with our custodians. I'm gonna release that publicly on YouTube. It needs to go out. It's that important. Yeah. So, that's my gift to you, to all of you, to the whole world. To make this quite complex topic of the five biological laws more accessible for everybody. There are a lot of great resources out there. Most of them are in German. Like the, the greatest resources are in German because like Dr. Hammer who, who founded those uh, found, who, who found those five biological laws, he's German and that's why there's a lot of a big school in Germany. Um, and I shared that in English and I put my personal twist into it, which might be valuable yeah to make it accessible so here's a link take some time and dive into it I have the feeling that it could turn your world like on its head it did the same for me oh. <laughs> this was my first first expedition again to the outdoors of course I'm not walking, I'm moving on all four, like like a crab like this, and that's uh, exhausting. And I really sense that my, my muscles are like <laughs> leaving my body. Oh, I hate that. Yeah, it needs to be built up when I'm back on two legs again. But. I'm very happy to have created this and to s support in the spread of this body of knowledge. Five biological laws, this needs to go out. Watch it, really. Watch it. Like, over the past years, um, I pioneered many like new innovative concepts. I was one of the first to spread human design back in 20... 18, 19, and the next big thing was spiral dynamics, which was yeah, an equal game changer for me and how I perceive the world. And I can tell you, like this one, that's the next shit. Really understanding our bodies, like on a physical level, while spiral dynamics offers more uh, like a meta perspective, and yeah. It's a game changer. Dive into it. I can highly encourage you to do that. But for now, let's do something else. We have haha 113 on the first of November. That means new month, new animal spirit. For the past month, I'll link you the video here. Watch it. October was a hugely transform transformative month. For the past month, I I was guided by the. Let me find it. For the past month, I was guided by the whale, expressing every part of myself, letting myself be fully seen. forgiveness, strength, perspective, don't judge into good and bad, like this, yeah, yeah, I did that over the past month, my foot, with like, yeah, really letting myself be seen in my, in my relationship with David, like in our co-creation of building Custodia, really acknowledging I can't do this by myself, 
and he for the past month he had the card of the lion stepping up taking responsibility to being committed and he really did that he like especially for the past 11 days while i was staying in bed but the time before as well like he really put in everything he had and like i'm so incredibly grateful for that like without him we we cannot i, I i've never could have built custodia in, in such a short period of time like it's it's insane so grateful for that and of course this began with me expressing that expressing how i feel like inviting him more and more and more and more into it and opening up this space so yeah i'm happy with the past month of the whale and now i'm curious what wants to be the unique spirit for november the last month before we're gonna open custodia 30 days left I feel goosebumps already without having pulled a card. <laughs> Shit! Something is coming. I sense that. Wow. There's a certain sense of respect. <laughs> and at the same time, tremendous anticipation for what wants to be embodied over the next 30 days. Whoa, I feel it. <laughs> mm. Is it this one? I guess it's this one. Let me get this one. Wow, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Wow. Wow, I've never seen this card. I think I already know every single card out of this deck. But no, that's a new one. Oh, oh my god. It's the reindeer. You don't need to endure what doesn't serve you. Turn yourself towards the sun. Reindeer! Reindeer boat! Oh, it's the unique message of the reindeer. Wow. I have goosebumps. Belief, trust, and intuition. Oh, oh, reindeer! I'm coming! You don't need to be on fire for every single thing. Some things. Oh, God. I shit. I already feel it. Some things are more a part of your nature and others aren't. Accept this fact that you won't achieve mastery in every discipline. If you're doing something that gives you energy instead of taking this from you, everything goes quickly. Sow the seeds on fertile soil and you will harvest very rich find your place <sighs> hmm. thank you reindeer thank you reindeer <sighs> goosebumps this really nicely connects to the to the whale and to the dynamic that I already shared with you with finding my place in custodia not trying to do everything just by myself inviting in other powerful co-creators to make this happen when it really comes down to my essence I sense that I'm here for let me turn off this fan really at the core of my being I I'm here to hold a vision every single day when I open my asana and check in what is on my plate today. I start with a reminder, a leader is the holder of a story 
and I deeply sense that. That's my path. To hold a story, to see something that is not there yet, and to believe in it with everything I am, and to articulate that, to make it, to make others t be able to taste it, although it's not there yet, so that together the spirit is high, and this thing that is not there yet gets achieved. I sense that this is my my number one contribution, and to hold hold the standards high. Yeah, to not sacrifice, to not make compromises here and there and there and there, but really to to hold the vision high and to for all of us to raise towards that as a human design projector I sense that I'm here for seeing potential seeing unutilized potential seeing where are the different places for the different people and then articulating that to them so that they can arrive at their place and out of all that together a beautiful symphony gets gets created and the reindeer invites me to let go of what I'm not and step fully into what I am while opening the space for other people to step into what I'm not but who, what they are <sighs> you don't need to endure what doesn't serve you Turn towards the sun. Hell yes. Hell fucking yes. Oh, it's already quite late. Leo arrived this afternoon after spending a week with his mommy. He's back here. Beautiful, beautiful. Before we close, I'd like to ask you for a favor. For our team, we are looking for a visual storyteller. Somebody experienced in film and in photography who would like to move in with us as a full-time resident and long-term co-creator documenting the building of this special place. This will enable us to spread our documentation of this journey beyond what I'm capable of creating. So if you know somebody who has the skills and at the same time might be up for an epic journey, please forward this. Whoever helps us find the perfect match receives an invitation for a two-week stay at Custodia Bali, all expenses covered except for your flight to Bali. So please share this in your network or in one-on-one -on -one with people who might be a match. Thank you. See you tomorrow. What a day. In bed. Again, day 11. But very productive. <sighs> yeah. Surrender to this journey. Yes, yes, yes. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. See you tomorrow. Bye bye.